Hi guys, this is AC Gamer back with a new video. Now in today's video, I'm going to be showing you my weekly progression. So it's been a week since the game has been out and it's time for me to show you what I've done so far. Taking a look at my team, taking a look at my characters, my progressions and everything like that. So yeah, this is not like a guides video. It's just for you guys to take a look at what I've done so far to see how far away you guys are, are away from me. I did top up in the game. So as you can see, my level is definitely higher. I spent a lot more currency. Wait, where did that currency come from? right oh i do have full stamina so after this video i definitely need to go ahead and farm i don't know where that came from because last time i checked i didn't have enough um anyways that's fine uh anyways let's take a look at what we have but don't forget guys i still have the giveaway video out so go into that video leave a comment down for hashtag 3k subscribers and anything else you guys want to say to be entered into the giveaway don't forget to like the video subscribe stay tuned for more content on counter side let's get to 5k subscribers at 5k subscribers i will be doing a giveaway anyways let's get right into the video before i actually do that i have a little rant slash confusion in my head i just got kicked out for my guild i do not know why they didn't tell me why i mean come on i joined your discord <laughs> i don't know why they kicked me out though literally every day i did give in donations and everything i put the premium currency in i logged in i made sure everything like that but i still got kicked out i'm very very confused like maybe it's because i didn't talk to them in the discord page but that's me that's who i am i don't like like initiating conversation unless people try and talk to me first if you're looking for me to go into the chat start saying what's up guys yeah how are you doing all of this stuff i can't do that i'm just like a quiet person anyways um i'm currently looking for guild obviously um i just recently realized i got kicked out um maybe i got kicked out today and early i don't know i didn't really check but yeah um as you can see getting kicked out is pretty upsetting and i'm still trying to find a guild but yeah i've tried to go into this guild I really doubt they would get invite me though or let me in is there any other guild out there who will take me tell me down in the comment section or oh, another level five one trust me guys i will give in donations put the premium currency i feel like i was being used guys i literally got used i used for my premium currency and then dumped in the street like a regular you know what i want to say side piece anyways let's get right into the video my progressions let's take a look at my characters first um i do believe i have most of the ssr characters available in this game currently i'm only missing two characters and i will be able to get one of them when i finish off the um event one of them the mission over here so you guys are probably wondering which one you guys want to pick with this it's up to you guys uh i'm just going to aim to get titan because he's one of the only characters i don't have um, actually yeah the only character i don't have in here and it will be better to just get one copy of him for now and then later on build him up because in the future titan and all the mech characters is he mech yeah all the mech characters will be like very very good in pvp just need one more character for them to be actually very very good so yeah getting titan will be my goal i know most people have only told me to get like kyle dupe or get elizabeth dupe yeah no i'm fine i'll just get some new characters obviously i don't know if i'm going to get titan in the future and then we also get if you take a look at the login stuff um i can't really take a look at it but the login stuff at the 30th day oh there it is attendance um you also get an ssr you get to select one i think yeah select one as well so then i guess i could pick any other characters from here that is fine and uh, yeah see that's all i need to do right now but anyways let's take a look at my characters most of my characters are level 90 so i have Kao wong currently about to go to level 100 i got yang harim level 91 zhao lin at level 90 i will be able to get her to 100 um the reason why i worked on her was so that i can get her um, basic stuff over here but i don't have enough um, what's it called uh, skill cards as of yet to do that but i will do that next up i got elizabeth pendragon um we got shinji who i need to actually um limit break i do have enough actually but i'm just missing the special atp core to just do that um i'm still deciding whether i want to do that with elizabeth or shinji um we also got evelyn uh, level 86 my fiona my main tank level 85 actually i want to switch over to this character over here as my main tank because she's pretty tanky she's very very tanky compared to my fiona but fiona literally dashes in front of, like rex so i might want to go ahead and use fiona that's why i use fiona instead of ivy but i use ivy on my second team and she works a wonders there i got kim Sobin worked on a little bit because she's very very good she does huge amount of damage um in rage she's the second highest damage dealer in my team so 
really really like that we also got the sniper chick 83 so yeah most of my characters are all level 83 some of them i'm just starting building them up and as you can see level 71 literally i got this character let's build her up straight away and there we go i'm building this our character as well as a mech character um i think i should be able to awaken him yeah I, I should be able to let me break him all i need to do is get into level 70 and i will be able to let me break him even further um with this character over here she's very very annoying in pvp as like right now but i know in the future even if i build her now she's going to be completely useless but i'm going to take my time with this character don't really want to use my precious atp core just to get her above level 70 as of yet i'm uh, probably going to do that with either actually i could do that with seeing Yoin right now um i'm not really too sure if i want to do that then i got the rest of the sr characters which i don't have enough time to build right now because atp core is just really really hard to get but there's loads of characters obviously that i want to build i got loads of dupe characters as you can see but do not use your dupes like i'm pretty sure everyone knows that wait until limit breaking happens or the awaken slash limit break happens to level 115 then you can use your dupes because you're going to require like 15 uh we got some of this stuff with impact stuff um implant i check i have enough i have um i'm overfilled or over capped with characters so i guess i'll do some plants yeah implants um certain characters you want to use and certain characters you don't want to use for implant um it would they will say like contract on top don't use those characters you want to sell them instead but none of them here i haven't actually summoned since like two days ago besides doing like the free summon every single time um which character do i want do i want to impart i guess i'll do it with her so we're going to go over here and let's work some wonders with her so implant um wait really you can't enhance any further oh she's max max oh i didn't even know that elizabeth pendragon wait so does that mean kyle is over also max um where's kyle wait did i do that for her as well i oh, know that's zero percent done where's kyle is he like dodging me or something he's gone okay it means i've probably implanted him completely uh we're gonna go over to shaolin i guess we do that for her um blah 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 1.5 yeah that's fine 1.5 uh we do that that's fine perfect let's see is there any character here that's got the nope so we do that as well that's fine i do have a lot of gold as you can see i've been farming a uh, free charge is it free charge or free stage whatever it's called where you get um s um, t5 gear that's what i've been farming as of now um some in characters i might want to implant in the future let me break let's see oh it's max with her that's fine uh let me break with this character yeah i'm missing this literally very very annoying implanting in this game is very annoying and we got this the reason why it says event over there is because i bought the uh, monthly pack which gives you that stuff as well so as you can tell i'm a whale or no it's not even a whale i'm a dolphin and i don't really want to level up characters right now so we're going to go over to management take a look at the gear i have so i'm trying to use tier 5 gear with all of my characters as you can see some of them have tier 5 tier 4 uh, i don't have the last one required to get that guaranteed uh, to get that increased crit damage because you always get the crit so i'm trying to get that gear let's see did i get an additional one when i got no i didn't yeah okay that's annoying next up we got some gear for her it's not the best obviously you want to go with um tier 5 gear with her i just put this random one on her just for now wait is that the crit damage no this is crit you don't want to put crit on her you want to put attack on her but i don't have any attack right now um yeah as you can see no attacks so for now this is just gonna do for her and as you can see yeah this is all the gear i have I'm trying to work on tier 5 gear perfect place to farm i think i already made a video on that but yeah this is my current um progression in terms of my characters let's go over to operations now none of the stages in this game are hard it's just finding time to do all of them is the main issue especially with the mainstream stuff doing the hard mode now i could definitely go ahead and free freestyle everything if i wanted to but sometimes i just want to make sure the ai does the stuff instead i just don't have time to be doing it but i did have time to do that for the uh free contract that was what's called for the last one i went ahead and freestyled the last two acts as you can see i did that over here with this one as well i didn't do that for this one but that's because I had time to do that. But none of the content in this game is that hard in terms of this stuff. It's just finding time to do that. Side story. To be honest, I really ignored this stuff. I didn't really care about the side stories. I mean, the characters are alright. 
I guess I could get those free SSR characters but at the same time it's not like I'm going to lose out if I don't farm them out right now but as you can see it's pretty easy to do that um not too hard go over to simulations there we go um let's see let's see if I can do this on uh, on video because it's kind of hard to do this a little bit I have to make sure Kim Sobin is able to do her stuff. With this one, I guess I'll just have to put Oto and my units manage to clear everything else. Um, all, all, all. I probably should switch out more characters uh, with this one. To another character that does all damage, which is her. She is a support class unit. And there we go. Um, we're going to use Oto and the Oto should work wonders for now. I think the Oto works better than me when I tried to do it, which is very surprising. Um, the Oto in this game in terms of moving characters in the uh, main quest is pretty trash in my opinion but for this one they seem to be working wonders you know look at this uh, I got some of my characters all at level 5 for the skill so especially with the support class unit she's able to heal with her ultimate a little bit which is fantastic and there we go and wonders like you can see it's going to be easy, especially because I'm level 90. In PvP, I'm stomping people now, finally. I used to get wrecked with like lower level players just beating the shit out of me. But finally, because all my levels, all my units are all level 90, I can easily do that stuff. So I am progressing in Arena. I haven't lost a match as of yet. Oh, I just jinxed it. But I have like a 7 win cool, um, streak right now. I think we can take a look at that. Should I do a, a PvP match now? No, I don't want to embarrass myself. I pretty much suck in PvP. That's all I want to say. I'm not only winning because I have a high level character, but yeah, like I said, I pretty much suck. Let's go over to Godlet. We go over to the rank battle. This says it. So with this weak ban, I don't really know what this means right now because even though I use the characters, I don't have any of this ban. Maybe this only happens when you rank up further. If I go over to recent battle records, there we go. So win, win. I'm just stumping people, even though you had Estorosa, even though she's so annoying. It's just stump, stump, stump. Wow, that's a lot of wins. I lost this one. Why? Let's see. Probably just bad management, I think. I don't know. There we go. Stumped. But if you look back, look at this. So much stump. <laughs> I suck. Anyway, PvP is amazing content though. Even though I get even though I lose, I still like it. Um, anyways, that is all I want to cover in today's video, my weekly progression so far. Um, I will try and do this every week at the end of it, so you guys know where you guys should be at roughly. Um, hopefully you guys are still liking this game because I definitely like this game. One of my favorite games to come out in 2021 as of yet. Can't wait for Punishing Grey Raven on um, is this Star Ultra Star something? I've forgotten the name. Um, it's another game that will be coming out in the future and I will obviously try and cover it. Um, don't want to wail too hard on this game though. I'm trying to save up for the Battle Pass that will be coming out in 3 months. Now if you guys actually want to prepare for the Battle Pass, I did see this in my comment section so all shout out to that guy who said it. But yes, the currency to use for the Battle Pass is going to be the admin coins and it's a lot required. It's 2000 um, something, 2710 or something. But um, you can actually get it relatively cheap if you decide to go over to um, subscription over here. So all you need to do is buy the this one over here and you should be fine. You should be able to get the 2000. So it's right now you can start buying this and then hopefully within like two months or three months when the game adds the battle pass, you will have enough. So this is probably what I'm going to buy every week or every month, sorry, in this game, only that. And then I should be ready for every battle pass. There is one battle pass character I definitely want to grab. I believe the first one we might get if we follow the same as the Taiwanese server will be the twin characters. But then the second one is a very, very good character who I want. She reminds me a lot of Azure Lane. But yeah, hopefully you guys like this video. Stay tuned for more content on counter side. Don't forget the giveaway video down in the comment section. It's been your boy AC Gamer. Stay hyped and I'm out.